just give a couple of uh, how it works things for you guys who, are, who have not been here. Uh, the way the class runs is I come up here and do 20, a wrap, a helpful wrap at the beginning, 20-ish, uh, depending on how many people are here. Sometimes it goes a little longer, sometimes a little shorter. Um, then you guys come up on stage one at a time, and during that time I come in with prepared material, but you can also ask me questions. Anything that's going on in your work, you're blocked, you're overwhelmed, you can't choose your projects, you're stuck, you're, you love it but it's not funny, you did a gig and it didn't go well, you got bad feedback from somebody, you got great feedback and what to do with it, uh, business questions, writing questions, performance questions, all of that. Uh, life, how you, even very practical things like I'm having a hard time carving out time to write, any of that stuff. We've been doing, we've been teaching for 10 years. I've been, Greg and I have worked in every medium. He was a screenwriter. Uh, we, I've acted at stand up and the uncat, just so much. So we really pull from all of that. And if we don't know something, I can guarantee you we know someone who does. <laughs> So uh, feel free to ask anything, and there's no there's no question too basic or too advanced. Anything that's just like stuff. So that's the beginning, and you can please, if it's happening during the middle of the week, and you know you want to know something, email it, and then I'll be sure to give it a little extra thought. But if it pops in on Saturday night or Sunday, just bring it in. So that's that, um, and then after we do this sort of opening rap esque area, we move into the. You time, and each of you gets five minutes on stage. Uh, I know you were concerned, Kelly, about that. You won't know when the time is up. We've got that taken care of. Gray has both a light and a buzzer, and that will go off. Uh, that will go off at four minutes and forty-five seconds ish, or four and a half minutes ish, and you wrap it up. Um, which doesn't mean you don't have to stop in the middle of a word, and if you have another half a page or you finish the idea that's fine then you get another five minutes of interactive time with us and we give you very detailed notes about what you're doing very personal notes and uh, if you don't have to fill up your five minutes you can use it because Alex we were talking and maybe we'll use the whole first especially the first class sometimes you want to do something more interactive with us and work question and answer you also might come in stuck and say, ask me questions about something. I'm not sure what I'm doing. They're, we're very good at asking you questions to prompt you if you need a prompt. Sometimes somebody might, you might come in and know, like, I want to do this thing about my dad, but I don't know what, and the thing, or the story, or I'm not sure how to integrate this story with that thing, or I had something that was a short story, but how do I turn it into a you know, live event? So any of that stuff, we can help you with that, and if you want to work interactively, we're, you know, I, for those of you who saw the uncab, I developed a very good back mic seal, and Greg is great with it, so we can ask you a lot of questions. So that's that. And um, our basic policy with uh, comments in class is you can always say, I loved something. We really prefer you don't make suggestions because it can be very confusing for the person getting notes to hear just a million suggestions from a lot of people. And um, you might have a great idea, but we've also had suggestions that were very off base and that's very confusing. But we love it when you tell someone you love something, and I may ask you at certain points to give me a, a hallelujah on something, because sometimes people will do something that was great and they won't believe me. So, <laughs> so we'll need a hallelujah on that, and so that you can always ask a question, though. Questions always, uh, always available. So, um, and then in terms of assignments and the work that you'll do out of class, we, uh, we used to give themes for writing prompts and we have a lot of those available. If you need those, we used to try to keep everyone on the same sort of prompt page because it was kind of interesting to see what different people will do with that. Ultimately, we have found that people make more progress if we keep everyone on their own page. One thing I love about this class is that everybody's doing different things. I know from seeing you, some of you are writing, doing spoken words, some of you are working on one-person shows, some of you are doing stand-up, some of you are pitching, some of you have long-term projects, some of you are doing all of it, and I, like Rebecca bring different things all the time. So I just really love that it becomes extremely non-competitive because everybody is on their own page doing their own work. 
So, but we're, uh, so we will give you uh, prompt assignments though, because sometimes people do come in and say, I'm not sure what to work on. So we'll give you stuff and we will give you personal assignments throughout. And we have a lot of different um, well, exercises that we've come up with and they will come up throughout the month. And if you need more homework, please do let me know. <laughs>